Scott, look at this. We have a taste of Ukraine and Italy right at our fingertips. This new coffee shop on Maumel Boulevard is the dreams come true of Bruno and Yuli, the owners of this new shop, and it has folks in this community eating it up. And now, so are we. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's, Let's eat it up. I'm Albanian, my father is Albanian, and from Mama's side, my grandma was Italian. And uh, I'm Ukrainian, yeah. Given what's going on in Ukraine, how are you and Yulia? Like, there is, there is not too much to say. Uh, like, her family is alive, you know, and that's important. Uh, we was dreaming to open a coffee shop a long time ago. So you were opening a coffee shop in Europe? We, we was like, like a week from opening over there, a week. But then Corona hit and messed up all our plans. Until destiny bring us to Arkansas, people usually asking why Arkansas? And we usually say like, why not Arkansas, you know? <laughs> I started drinking coffee like five years old, <laughs> I think with uh, grandma. So since uh, baby, I know how to do espresso. Yeah. We decided to do like more Italian coffee, more classic coffee, less sugar. Bruno says this is going to change our world. So I have the top seller. This has got honey, and he says pure, real honey, but the flavor is just really delicate. That is the perfect description. Uh, yeah. I have the caramel and mocha. Ooh. Like you said, you can just appreciate the coffee. That's what really shines through with this. I'm doing uh, sometimes puff pastries with the mashed potato and mushrooms, which is very typical for Ukraine. Sweet Danish. With like blueberry cream cheese, strawberry cream cheese. On a croissant, we are doing like sandwich. It can be savory, it can be sweet. Giant croissant. This is going to fill you up. So I went with the roasted apples topped with a little bit of raisins and honey. How about that combo? I cannot wait. What do you have over here? So this right here, we have strawberry, mm. banana, and Nutella. Michaela, that is loaded. That is the trifecta of oh. all trifectas mm. for a croissant. OK, OK. Mm. Mm. It's all over my mouth here. It's all over yours. We come here and the uh, guest has accent for yeah, us. Yeah, like, I remember my first time working with an American and they was like, Bruno, you have so much accent. <laughs> and I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> I, I understand nothing. <laughs> like, <laughs> what a wonderful story and look who just walked in to help us talk we about it. How, how amazing was it meeting those two? It was Absolutely amazing. It was such mm. a good experience, and the coffee, the food, amazing. Mm. Amazing. You know, we go to these eat it ups, and some you leave with some some feelings, and oftentimes mm. it's indigestion. <laughs> <laughs> in, nice. in this case, uh, not from I, the food, just from <laughs> eating so much. I think. In yeah. this case, I, they they just touched me. Their spirit. Mm -hmm. um, what's going on in Ukraine yes. and, and how it inf impacts them? It's a very real thing, uh, and, and the way they talked about that, uh, him specifically, of course, uh, d just a wonderful people, and as they called it coming to Arkansas was their destiny mm -hmm. and it took a lot of tragedy and, and, and overcoming tragedy to get here but they're in love with the place and the Maumel community has said we love these people we are embracing them they are a part of our area uh, and it's just such an encouraging thing to see and their story that? is a love story tell us yeah. how they met so they met on a cruise ship <laughs> and that's where it all started and they were just going around the world with each other and then here they are in Arkansas here now they are and here's some Super exciting cool. news uh, they're located on Maumel Boulevard open six to two and if you want to go there today please Please do tell them I said hello. I, I want to go by there. I want to be their friends, actually. <laughs> yeah. But you might not have to drive over to Maumel Boulevard anytime soon. In about three weeks ish, give or take, mm. uh, they're actually going to be opening a second location. That's brand new news that we're happy to break to you. Mm -hmm. And that location is going to be in downtown Little Rock. <gasps> Love it. That Love it. Go yeah. over big. We'll only be yes. there five days a week, so perfect. Well, they're only open five days a week, so it'll <laughs> be good. Do they speak each other's language or do English? I, I think so. Uh, they're very fluent. His, you know, his mm. grandma was a, a Italian, and he's like, I want you to understand. And, and so he speaks Aww. very fluent Italian. Uh, he's Albanian, she's Ukrainian, mm -hmm. and I, I loved their accents. Deal. They were perfect. They were such a fun time, and just getting to learn about mm -hmm. them and their whole story was such a great day. Amazing stuff. Oh. Thank you guys very much.